Hello, here is my motorized bicycle. The most recent one. Made with the three and a half horse Briggs and Stratton. Got for two dollars at Dinkies one time. I'm using a cover from a push mower engine, which by coincidence fit on here. And it had the pull strap directed down, so I went ahead and put something more modern on there. Brought the kill switch up front. Use a generic throttle I use on most of my projects. We bought brakes, caliber brakes, like on a normal bicycle. Front and rear. That is called a pineapple bushing, what is holding that on. Over here is a tensioner, or an idler, some people would call it. Now this has been a lot of experimentation to get the right steel and the right, just the right ratio of things. But it works really well and it keeps the chain really tight. On this side, I've got a clutch, a normal clutch from... I don't remember where I got it, but it's a, it's a basic clutch you can get. And then right here, this is a 10 tooth clutch. This is a 28 tooth year. Over here is a 10 tooth over there. And down there is a 48 tooth, I think. You can see how I made this in here. Jack shaft assembly. And a little exhaust pipe that I got new. And right there is a little throttle assembly. There we go. Using an intake off of a lawnmower as well. Now I'll start her up for you. Flip the switch. Put a little choke on it. 